amazing. When I first met Russ, I immediately thought of him as an amazing mastermind. Russ masterfully interpreted Crosby and Sandy Kemper's vision for AFA, and over the span of 20 years, Russ is the mastermind behind all scenes and conversations, mentoring young leaders, encouraging timid personalities to explore their potential, and suggesting to questionable minds to look at the bigger picture. Russ, as you know, I want to congratulate you, but I feel you already know that's why I'm part of this celebration. You know, Russ, I'm reminded of the discussions we had putting this prestigious honor in place. I really don't believe there's anyone else who deserves this award more than you this year. Russ, you are this award, the 2016 AFA Leader in Agriculture. And those outstanding recipients before you were individually and collectively like you with amazing qualities in knowledge and service in agriculture, food, and our environment. Russ, you are the excellent candidate for the 2016 AFA Leader in Agriculture Award. And yes, Russ, congratulations for all you have done so well and with so much inspiration to those around you and those surrounding you. I'm reminded, as well as you are, of our founder of the Agriculture Future of America organization, the late Crosby Camper. He often remarked, there's only two things you can leave that are worth anything. That is how your life has touched another life and made it a little better, or what you've contributed through the arts. If you've influenced any of that in a positive way, that's legacy you've given to make the world a little better. Russ, your life has and continues to touch every one of our AFA professionals. That's also legacy you've given to make the world a little better. It's my honor to serve on the AFA Board of Directors and to be an integral and an intriguing part of this organization's growth over the 20 years. Russ, do you remember when we first met in Litchfield, Illinois? After four and a half hours later, you knew more about me than I thought I needed to share. And I was amazed how interested you were in understanding the challenges along my life highway. I was at a juncture in my life, wanting to give back and helping young women desiring a career in agriculture. Therefore, I had started an internship through my alma mater, the University of Illinois. I called the internship Opportunities for Women in Production Agriculture and Related Areas. Boom! The next thing I knew, you asked me to be part of the AFA Board of Directors, for which I was excited. Plus, I was the first female voice in the discussions. You know, Russ, I don't remember you ever mentioning that I'd be the first in the class of diversity. Well, it's been a while. but. It's been a rewarding opportunity, and I've continued to share the opportunity with many outstanding men and women. Let's speak to another personal trait that you have. It's thoughtful dialogue. I never hear you say, that's a bad idea. Instead, you say, let's think about, it, or what do you think about this? But then you plant a seed to activate conversation that inevitably empowers student professionals to think about the box, but then think out of the box. You are the back end of great ideas and our student professionals and your staff grow those seeds into successful programmatic ideas. Russ, I so respect how you empower those that want, deserve, and need an opportunity to give back from a part of their life experiences. You are not only respected by many, but also loved by many more. Russ, from the bottom of my heart, congratulations.